Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. South Korean actress Song Haikyo is one of the busiest and biggest names in Asia. Here are some of the 8 things that you need to know about her. Song Haikyo is a household name in her native South Korea and is one of the Asia's biggest stars. Ask anyone about Hallu and you'll most likely hear her name on their lips. She's particularly well known for helping spread the Korean wave in the region, no doubt in a part with her notable roles in various dramas and movies such as My Girl and I 2005 and Full House 2004, which catapulted her to superstar status. But for those who have only heard about the actress and are interested in learning more, you've come to the right place. Here are 8 things to know about Song Haikyu, one of Asia's busiest stars. 8 things to know about Korean actress Song Haikyu. Number 1. She started modeling at the age of 14. Growing up, Song wanted to be an athlete, not a movie star, and she was training to become a figure skater. But in 1996, when she was 14 years old high school student, her parents entered her in Sang Kyung model contest and she won. Soon afterwards, Song landed supporting roles on television variety shows including One of Pair 1997 and First Love 1996-1997. Number 2. She got her first break in 2000. Four years later, she nabbed the leading role in television drama series Autumn in My Heart 2000 which follows a cancer-stricken teen who falls in love with her adopted partner. It was one of the most popular shows that year and helped the launch of the Korean wave or the Hallo, a period of increased global interest in South Korean pop culture which also launched Song to international stardom. What solidifies her status in Asia is the gambling, gambling drama All In 2003 with Lee byung Hon and the romantic comedy. Full House 2004 opposite K-pop star Rain. She also took on her first big screen role in My Girl and I 2005 which received a cult following in Asia. Number 3. She is a prolific brand ambassador. Song, who is often touted as one of South Korea's greatest beauties, has landed myriad brand trans sponsorships. She recently added Italian fashion house Fendi to her ever-growing list of luxury brand endorsements, becoming its first ever gro Korean global ambassador. She is also an ambassador for Chomet, Bottega, Venta and the Korean skincare brand Shulwaso. Number 4. She is an award-winning actress. Throughout her career, Song has proved herself to be an accomplished actress. In 2013, she nabbed her first Grand Prix award, which is the highest accolade for South Korean actors for her work in the television drama That Winter the Wind Blows 2013. She also has three Daesung's Grand Prize, the highest award in South Korea under her belt, earning them in 2013 for That Winter the Wind Blows, opposite Jo In Sung and Descendants of the Sun 2016 opposite Song Jong Ki and in 2016 she was awarded the President's Award at the 7th Korean Popular Culture and Arts Award. Number 5. She worked with two Hong Kong directors. Song played a supporting role in Wong Kar Wai's The Grandmaster 2013 where she learned Cantonese and martial arts. After that, she worked on romantic epic The Crossing 2014 with director John Woo. The movie was originally announced in 2008 but was cancelled the following year and then was brought back in 2011. But Wu's recovery from tonsils tumor removal procedure in 2012 delayed the production as well as the scheduling conflicts with the cast. The movie eventually began filming in June 2013. Another movie that Song did overseas in the Chinese movie, The Queen's 2015, directed by Taiwanese singer, actress and writer Annie Yi. Number 6. She is making her drama comeback. After the success of Descendants of the Sun, Song took a two-year hiatus and returned to drama with the romantic melodrama Encounter 2018 alongside Park Bo Kam. Song chose to go on a break after the conclusion of Encounter. She is said to make her highly anticipated comeback in Now We Are Breaking Up opposite Jang Ki Yong. The drama is held by My Love from Another Star 2013 director Lee Jil Bo, while Ji In will be penning the drama as a screenwriter. Song is going to play Ha Young in a trendy and intelligent manager of a fashion label's design team. Number 7. She is a fashion icon. Besides her status as one of 
Asia sought after actress and one of the highest paid actress in South Korea, Song is also a fashion icon in her own right. She is a honoree of Titleist Asia's most stylish 2020 list and fashion brands such as Fendi, Bottega, Venta all chose her as the brand ambassador thanks to her timeless beauty and fashionable looks. As an ambassador of Chomet, Song is also the face of iconic Jo Sweet collection representing sensuality femininity and playfulness. In an exclusive interview with Taylor, she says, I really want to explore the ways on how we can empower women to be their best selves and how we could celebrate femininity in various ways. I will try to embody the spirit of Josephine in everything that I do to be progressive but steadfast in my beliefs and discipline and be assertive yet elegant. I think this is something that all women should strive to be, she adds. Number 8. She is the part of the strong trio Te Hai Chi. Te Hai Chi is the name given to the three of South Korea's most popular actress. In addition to Song, Kim Tae Hee and Jun Ji Hyun are part of the trio. These three actresses bought about the hello wave and spread the popularity of Korean dramas all over Asia. With this, we come to the end of this video. If you like this video, please do like and share with your family and friends and don't forget to click on the bell icon. Thank you for your continuous support. I'll be back with another video. Until then, stay safe and stay healthy. Bye.